hi guys welcome back to my channel so um i'm gonna go through the ingredients with you guys right now so the first thing you're going to need is obviously our uh, black soap so this is the black soap i'm using this is one cup of black soap basically now for the liquid we're going to need aloe vera confirm this is 100 percent gel no alcohol added then um we're also going to be needing some extract so this is basically the liquid we're going to be using is this is hibiscus extract this is if you don't know hibiscus if you're in nigeria this is called zobo so this is zobo extract so this is the extract we're going to be using now for the oils we're going to be using um let me start this is a powder let me start from the oil we're going to be using um some orba oil this is orba oil then um rose hip oil some lemon oil some turmeric oil um we're going to be needing some vitamin e oil um our rescue oil i talked about this in my um afcast soap video rescue oil it is good for stretch mark and anti-aging also the same thing with bio oil i'm going to put in some bio oil as well you can this two are actually optional if you don't if you don't have this it's not composite to add these two they basically do the same thing that is why i sh i bought this two to this video i'm not going to be using the two i'm only going to be using one of it basically rescue oil but the two do the same thing and it is optional and then um the oil the last oil that we're going to be adding is t3 oil this is very good for acne blemishes and all of that then um this is our vanilla fragrance and our preservative um the name has clean but this is optifine plus this is the preservative that i'm going to be using now let's move to the powders for the powders i'm going to be using some camwood powder this is camwood powder this is actually camwood chunks i'm going to like use my hand to grind it to make it into a powder um, it's very soft so you can use your hand to grind it this is um sandalwood powder this is some sulfur very important it's good for rashes and pimples and it basically um some liquorice powder i'm going to be adding some of this um orange peel powder this is if you have lemon peel powder you can go ahead and add it it's the same thing just citrus powder and of course our olive oil our turmeric powder this is like i don't make any black soap without this and the last but not the least is our cashew bentonite clay this is optional as well if you don't have it it is not compulsory so that is basically all our ingredients that we're going to be using it is straightforward i don't want this video to be too long so i just want to go straight into the point okay so if you don't see how i mix all this then keep on watching so it's been a while that i've used my mortar and paste too so i'm gonna go ahead and put our black soap in the mortar and i'm just gonna use my hands to like break it up like i'm just breaking it up now the next thing i want to do is i want to add my powders so i'm going to start with my sulfur powder so i'm going to be adding one, one spoon each of the powders so this is actually one spoon so yeah then after our sulfur the next powder you want to add is the camwood powder this is about Next one is our orange peel powder. Sumwick powder. So I'm going to make this um, recipe has to be a turmeric black soap. So we're going to be adding a lot of turmeric into this formulation. So a lot of turmeric is going into it now our next powder is our sandalwood powder liquor ice and then our calcium bentonite clay so i forgot to mention this in when I was talking about the ingredient, this is miracle powder. Miracle powder is amazing. It's an amazing ingredient. It helps with burns. It helps with black spots. Helps with pimples, black knuckles, brown patches, stretch mark, aftershave, and etc. It is an amazing. It is very small, but it is small but mighty. So I'm going to be adding a pinch. I'm going to be adding a pinch of the miracle powder into this mixture. Now the next thing I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and add the liquid. So I'm going to start with my aloe vera gel. So I'm going to be using about one tablespoon of this. 
then the next thing is our hibiscus extract you can use any extract that you have you can use pineapple extract you can use whatever extract that you have moringa any kind of herbs any kind of fruits so i'm going to be adding one tablespoon of this actually infuse this um hibiscus extract in rose water so this is basically rose water and hibiscus now let's move on to the oils um this is a hover oil for the oils i'm going to be using an half tablespoon for the oils so a hover oil rose hip oil lemon oil turmeric oil It's a turmeric formulation, like I said, a turmeric black soap for dark skin. So I'm going to be adding about one and a half tablespoon of turmeric oil. So the next thing is our rescue oil. So I'm going to be adding some vitamin E oil into this solution. Now. So I'm going to be adding about three capsules and I'm not just going to dump this capsule into the soap. I'm going to cut it open, then I'm going to pour it into the formulation so what you want to do is you want to get your scissors and you want to cut this open and then pour it into the formulation so i'm going to be using about five i'm just going to be adding more so i'm going to be adding three more this helps your skin to glow oh my god it literally give you can you guys see the way my hand is glowing already so it literally helps your skin glow and then my tea tree oil and it's about 10 drops this helps with blemishes pimples acne scars etc and now that we have all this air i'm going to try and give it a really really rough mix with my spatula now at this point you want to pound it i'm going to pound it to combine the old ingredients together so at this point if you think your formulation is too dry like mine is actually too dry right now you want to put a little bit like add it in minus quantity you want to put a little bit of your extracts so i'm going to, going to be adding i'm actually giving you doing this so you guys can get the measurements um, that is why I have a spritz bottle. I can easily just put it in there. You guys can see it's coming together quite easily right now, unlike how dry it was before. Yeah, you can see the turmeric. Can you see how yellow? Oh my god, this is so luscious. The turmeric is like in there. <laughs> So you want to pound it till it is combined um, this is what it is looking like right now so it is well combined now at this point don't forget we haven't added our fragrance and our um, preservative so I'm going to be adding the fragrance first just a little bit I don't want it to be too much just a little bit of fragrance this is vanilla by the way it smells amazing and then i'm going to be adding my preservative and um, let me first let me mix the fragrance in first and now i'm going to be adding preservative which is also just about that amount in you go and i'm going to mix it together combine it thoroughly Guys, if if you're an engineer, Igbo or Yoruba, then you will know. And even Aousa, I think Aousa people used to do too well. You know how to turn this thing so well. Like I'm Yoruba, so I make a lot of Amala and a lot of Eba. So this is very easy for me to turn. It comes very easy. So just turn like you're turning Eba. Or amala or gari or tuo shinkafa just turn it right here. Yeah. 
so guys this is basically a black soap for dark skin this soap will surely glow your skin like follow my guides my do's and don'ts on using black soap and i promise you you are going to come back and thank me after making this recipe okay it's a very simple recipe a very straightforward recipe but it does wonders it performs amazing wonders i'm gonna go right down i'm gonna pack this up into my um retail containers and i'm gonna be right back so guys i've gone ahead and i've filled my black soap up in my um jar this is what my jar looks like um so i'm gonna put in my label on it right now this is my brand i'm gonna go ahead and i'm going to put the label on the black soap so yeah this is a 250 ml container it's a 250 ml container and i sell this for 4000 naira if you want to purchase okay so this is my black soap this is a black soap for dark skin this is turmeric black soap for dark skin um a lot of you guys have been asking me for this so here it is if you try this recipe out let me know in the comment section below and let me know how it works for you um so see you guys thank you guys for watching if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel be sure to hit the subscribe button and be sure to hit the bell button so you get notified every single time i upload a video till next time bye